Here opens the court of steadfast Christian and graceful Hélène, king and queen of Antir and the third of their names. Your Majesties, Osric and Sigrun, the Baron and Baroness of Wildsmere, have business in this court. Your Majesties, we have served as your representatives in your most easternmost lands with persistence and valor. But now we are weary and come to be relieved of this burden. We understand your desire and thank you for all of your service. Have you released all of those in fealty to you? We, we have, have, your majesties. majesties. Your Majesties, we have been honored to serve your kingdom as and the people of Wildsmere as Baron and Baroness, but it is now time for us to resign this service and render the barony into your care and keeping. We hear your request and grant you relief of your duties as Baron and Baroness of Wildsmere. Though we are loath to lose such servants as you have been to us, we release you from your oaths of fealty. <laughs> Harold, call forth the ones we have chosen to be our royal representatives in the barony of Wellsmere. Michael of Lancaster and Arnora Grimm's daughter, their majesties invite your presence in their court. Michael and Arnora, their majesties do here invite your service to their barony and kingdom. Will you accept from them the title and responsibilities of Baron and Baroness of Wildsmere, and will you swear fealty to the crown of Ontier for this barony? We, we will. will. Right mindful that you will be the representatives of the crown of Ontier, do you understand that you will be responsible for the defense, nurturing, and well-being of this barony? We, we do. do. I, Christian, King of Ontier, do now name you Michael of Lancaster, Baron of Wildsmere to stand in our place in all matters ceremonial. Wear this coronet as symbol of your title and of the responsibilities you now bear. I, Helen, Queen of Ontier, do now name you Arnora Grimm's daughter, Baroness of Weldsmere to stand in our place in all matters ceremonial. Wear this coronet as symbol of your title and of the responsibility you now bear. Do you now swear fealty for the barony of Wildsmere to Christian and Hélène, your liege lord and lady, that you will obey their lawful commands in all matters that concern this realm, that you will uphold the crown and kingdom of Antir, and mindful that the harmony of your barony and of the kingdom springs from your own deeds, that you will deal courteously with those of every degree, so long as their majesties remain sovereigns of Antir. I so swear. And we, for our part, do swear now our fealty to the Baron and Baroness of Wellsmere. We promise to protect your house with all of our power, so long as we remain sovereign of Antir. So say we, Christian, King Antir. So say we, Helen, Queen Antir. Be it known to the people of Antir that Michael of Lancaster and Arnora Grimm's daughter will henceforth be known as Baron and Baroness of Wildsmere. For the Baron and Baroness of Wieldsmere, a joyous noise. drums beat wild and banners blow free dream 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 away with me and i'll build you a home in Weldsmere. 
Dream, dream, there's a barney grand for the chivalrous heart and the helpful hand. Dream, dream, there's a wondrous land where I'll build you a home in Wellsmere. The lanterns, lanterns, how bright they'll shine in a barney camp here out of time. The lanterns, lanterns, how bright they'll shine on the home we will build in Wellsmere. Dream, dream, there's a barney grand for the chivalrous heart and the helpful hand. Dream, dream, there's a wondrous land where I'll build you a home in Wellsmere. Citizens of Wellsmere and Silverheart, welcome to this, our first address as your Baron and Baroness. We want to thank their majesties, Christian and Helen, and all of you for your trust you have placed in us, and we will do our best to live up to your faith and our ability to lead Wieldsmere. We miss seeing you all in person. These are trying times, and the dream may be a bit harder to keep alive, but we shall keep it alive until we can once again all gather with our chosen, chosen community. Arnora and I are going to have an active virtual presence until we can go back to having events. We encourage you to attend online guild meetings and council meetings, and we're going to come up with new and inventive ideas of ways to stay involved with all of you. We would like for you to be virtually active with us too. So please share your ideas for online activities, competitions, and socials so that we may still enjoy the camaraderie of our friends. That said, it takes many hands to make, to make a barony run smoothly and efficiently. We have been so gratified by all the help of all the people who have stepped up and offered to help us and who have pledged their service on our retinue and who have offered their wisdom. We are especially pleased by the new baronial officers. At the August baronial council meeting, four new officers were approved. We would like to heartily congratulate our new seneschal, Arcos Vedas Ursabet. We know she will manage the barony with wit and wisdom. Our new deputy exchequer will be the Honorable Lady Isabella Fleming, and we are so pleased she is learning this important duty. Our new gold key is the Honorable Lady Kathleen O'Donnelly, who has also graciously offered her service as our baronial seamstress and laundress. And last, but certainly not least, our new chatelaine, Lady Asheen McDougall, who has recently immigrated here from the Kingdom of North Shield. We are excited to have her skill and experience in guiding our new friends into the barony. We will be pleased to witness these and all other officers' oaths of fealty to us and the barony at our first in-person event. Please join us in a toast to these dedicated officers. If you would like to be an officer, or if you'd like to steward an event, we encourage you to attend the virtual council meetings or to contact our Seneschal and she can guide you in your interests. If you would like to be on our retinue, or if you would like to serve in court, we encourage you to contact our head of retinue. The members of the Sergeantry of Wieldsmere served Baroness Sigrun faithfully and well, and she has now freed them of their fealty oaths to her. I will not be requiring that the sergeantry swear fealty via a virtual court. It is my preference that we wait until our first real court where those who wish it may come forth and swear fealty in person. I am also pleased to announce that I will be instituting two new sergeantry paths for Wieldsmere, Lancer and Siege Engineer. Test development is already underway and it will be exciting to welcome the premier members to these new disciplines. We are reaching out to our neighboring baronies of Wastekeep and Volkenfeld, and each of the Inland's groups work together in reinforcing the bonds of friendship and cooperation that have long been the strength of the Inland's. It is our hope that we may all come closer together, even though the times may keep us apart for now. 
We have exciting plans for our time as your Baron and Baroness. We are already working with our heralds to register as many of the Baronies existing awards as possible, and we have several new awards we will be submitting to the College of Heralds. Our Seneschal, Ursabet, is already working on a plan to update the baronial customaries, and she will be sharing more on that process in upcoming meetings. Lastly, we would like to introduce the key members of our court. We are very fortunate to have so many great people come forth and offer their service. Our head of retinue is the Honorable Lady Isabella Fleming. If you have any questions or would like to serve on retinue, please contact her. Our court coordinator is Lady Isa al Damashkia. Our baronial scribe is Lady Fiametta. The Lady of the Chamber and personal assistant to the Baroness is Her Excellency Bianthane Vila Carrara. Our aides de camp are Lady Caitlin, Honorable Lady Ricca di Bardiccio for Michael, and Honorable Lord Fergus Biggs for myself. We want to thank them and all of our staff for helping us in our new roles. If you would like to serve in our court, please contact us. There is a place for everyone who wants to learn and be a part of the pageantry of Baronial Court. We look forward to serving you as your Baron and Baroness, and also to having fun with all of you when we can meet again in person. Until then, we remain in service of the dream and look forward to serving you all virtually. Long live Wieldsmere! Long live Silverheart! Long live Christian, Christian and, and Helene! Helene. On, On cheer! cheer. Dream, dream, dream away with me when the drums beat wild and banners will free. Dream, dream, dream away with me and I'll build you a home in Wellsmere. Dream, dreams of Benny Grant with a chivalrous heart and a 